Well guys, a little after we got that mouse, I showed you that uh, raccoon. He was behind the pond. He came up through the side. Um, I took a shot at him, but I missed. And we're probably 300 yards. I followed him through the woods. And uh, sorry, but I spent so much time tracking him down and finding where he's at and I didn't record him but I did get him to here there he is there he just landed and you can see he's just just took me forever to to get him um, I was waiting for him again he was way up at the trees and I was just waiting for him to show his face and I saw his eyes in the scope and put it right between his eyes down he went but he was when I say he was hang on a second let me get a light where's my light He was up. Follow that tree. All the way up above that branch right there. And he just he just looked through and down he came. Let's see. Well, it's Sunday night, and uh, we're out mouse hunting, and I noticed a raccoon coming down the creek here, heading right for the house, and uh, as you see, it was a 27-yard shot, shooting a Crossman 14 grain, 14.9 grain domed hollow point, and uh, See me over there. Land it up right there. There he is. There's still one more. Um, and again, the reason it's black and white, there's uh, some paint right here. Yeah. Um, kill myself out here but uh, there's still a bigger one out here he's a uh, great big one looks like a friggin dog we're waiting for him to come he showed his face the other day and he's uh, real skittish so hey again if you go visit this video it needs a little love doesn't have too many views so go look at that one uh, subscribe to the channel I like doing this if you like seeing it so subscribe let me know leave a comment in the bottom I'll talk to you later guys